Okay, question nine. The diagram shows a trapezium A, B, C, D. And we're told that the length, the length um, A, D from A to D is X. So I'm going to write that on the diagram. We're told that B, C is the same length as A, D. Well, we know A, D. It tells us B, C is the same. So that must be X. We're told that A, B is twice the length of A, D. So this line up here, this side is twice the length of this side. And if this is x, this has got to be 2x. And then finally, we're told that dc is 4 centimeters longer than ab. So this side here, dc, has got to be the 2x that this is up here, but also add 4 centimeters on or add 4 onto it. Now, the next bit of information we're given is that the perimeter of the trapezium is 38. So that's telling me that if I add up all the sides, the perimeter is the distance around the whole shape. If I add up all the sides, the answer will be 38. We're asked to find the length of AD. Okie doke. So the perimeter is 38. We've got all the sides, so let's add them up. So if I say that 2x plus x plus 2x plus 4 plus x, that's all of our sides. If I add them all up, the answer must be 38 centimeters. Okay, so what we've got to do is essentially, if we're asked for AD, this side here, we've got to solve for x. Let's work out what x is by solving this equation. Collecting like terms together, we get 6x plus 4 equals 38 centimeters, which means taking 4 off both sides, we're going to get 6x is going to equal 34, which means dividing both sides by 6, we get x must equal 34 over 6. Now, you can actually leave your answer like that. There is no need to simplify your answer. It didn't specify give your answer in any particular way. I am, for the purposes of the question and for the viewers, just going to state that AD, if I simplify this, I know that's going to be 5 and 2 thirds. You could check that on your calculator if you wish, but essentially that was um, that's how we convert this from a, a top-heavy fraction to a mixed number.